We're in good shape volunteers, Jenna James, as you now join us live. But hey, th the rest of the year, still important to think about that. Yeah, you can always volunteer the rest of the year. And if you still want to find a way to give back to the Stevens Center today, you can do it simply by getting an ornament. Take a look. These are done by local students. It's their ornaments for charity. You've seen Brandon and Aiden on WWT 6 News in the past. This is the fifth year they're selling their ornaments for charity. Now, when they first started, they had four original designs. Get this. They now have over 50 and 1,400 ornaments to sell. The boys have put in a lot of work. Two months worth of weekends. You're willing to give up all those weekends to help people? Yeah. Pretty cool on your tree, and um, it really helps a good cause. And we think they're pretty cool, too. They've sold to 48 states and a number of countries. So far, they've raised about $2,500 of their $10,000 goal. That money will go toward hygiene products and blankets here at the Stevens Center. They're going to do all the work. They're just going to bring it all here. I kind of want to show you. They yeah, were they nice right enough here. to give me one. This is one of the bags that you can get. They do have some kits. Eventually, it'll look like this. Uh -huh. Turn into a cute little... Uh, Christmas oh penguin. God. Very cute. Yes, right. Or they do come pre-made too if you want one like that. But you can go on our website. I'll post a link on there where you can get involved and get one of these ornaments from them. I love it. Those kids are amazing. I know. So young. 13 and I think 8 or 9 and making this many ornaments. Amazing. Tremendous story and just one of many mm -hmm. tremendous stories here at the Stevens Center. Jenna, thanks for that report. It's